You know, I have like so many traps out there. You know, the woods are full of my traps. Oh, right now. yeah. Are you aware of this? I mean, the woods are full of my traps, and we've got two people that are running naked through the woods, these two. <laughs> and they just can't wait. Are we on they that just can't show? help themselves. Naked right and afraid. Like, la di la di la di la di da. Yeah, you clearly And I know. just have the bear traps just sitting everywhere, hidden. It's so crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I was, was thinking, was I looked in your eyes and I said, I think probably he has queens. But I just don't think you're gonna give me all the money. Stupid if you get called, right? Like, you bluff me, bluff me, bluff me. There. It looks good, like, I mean, like, these are the hands everybody talks about. Look, Schwann bluff Phil, somebody bluff Phil. They don't, <laughs> they don't notice the end of the night that I was the big winner. But they, that hand does go viral. Did you like the lottie, 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 da? I thought it was a nice touch to the story. La -di -la -di -la -di -la -di -da. <laughs> That's us running naked around the bear trap. It is, it is. Guys are running naked in the woods. La-di-la-di-la-di-da. Life is a, good. Life but is in good. a southern accent. You got all your chips <laughs> because of the 200. We're giving away $50. It's very simple. Here's how. Step one, go to WPTGlobal.com. Step two, sign up using bonus code YT77. Step three, deposit at least $1 and you better act quickly because we're only giving away $50 to 100 people. Six players putting up their own cash, gambling it up, Jamie with a quick fold, and now Schwan Lu picks up a pair of nines. 175. Yeah, well, 4,000 people, and I'm down there deep, but. Field sizes is irrelevant though because when you the well, mix, a lot of these no a lot so of these a lot right of these no limit events back. you can enter enough time like you're just always getting into the final couple hundred. I mean, yeah, there's not a no limit event you play you don't get yes, to the final couple hundred. Think of, you think of each of those really flights as different tournaments. It's occupying several days. Eight of your time four deuce, a very hours. nice board if for the pocket nines of Schwan Lu. I always, I mean, I it seems pretty hard not to get deep in a no limit event. <laughs> wow. I can show you wow. That. He's right. Well, I mean, it's it's pretty easy. I mean, Eight I'm not very good. I'm not very good at no limit. I just always get there. Right? <laughs> All right. Phil in just position just with fives will raise to 800, getting some protection and information at the same time. It's a nice raise because it puts her under pressure. You can get a free card if nothing good happens on the turn because she'll probably check with him making the power move. Now, she makes his call, and here we go with the turn, and he could improve. Six of spades. So there you go, check, check. River card four doesn't help Phil. Well, I think Phil's check on the turn will embolden Schwan on the river, and she'll look to get value. The question is how much does she think Phil can call? And she bets 800. 800. I hope he didn't get lucky and hit a four on me. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Every time I set him up. <laughs> Two queens right here. Jesus, she's going to hit a four on me. <laughs> now the Canadian hand. Gretzky's? Ah, that's fair. Huh? You had the best hand. It's OK if so it's fair. <laughs> <laughs> nice hand, Wayne. Thanks. Why is ninth the Canadian hand? Gretzky's. Gretzky's. Oh, okay. Wayne Wayne Gretzky. See, I told you I know nothing you about know sports. I know, I know who he is. Our yes. Canadians, apparently. Yes. I mean, if you know. It's a great hand from Schwan Lu. Norman Chad's dropping blue at my house, so I just canceled my schedule. The dog. <laughs> is this a bit? <laughs> Prior at all. When was the last time you played a Hold'em cash game? Whenever the last time I filmed Poker Night in America right. was. Yeah. <laughs> a non-filmed Hold'em cash game. That's great. It's got to be like a One, decade. I played Poker Night in America. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't know. Yeah, I don't. David Baker, a nice little 6-5 of diamonds making this call, and Schwann with a pair of deuces. Right, playing some mixed games is that you could always pretend the game you're playing is not your game. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's just not my game. Yeah, that's not my game. Now it's back on Helmuth. <laughs> with his sevens. Does he want to try a squeeze play, perhaps? Is that what he's thinking? What you thinking about? <laughs> what do you think I'm thinking about? <clears throat> Bitcoin. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not worried about you two, I can tell you that. Obviously. Wow. I never have anything. Well, you know, I limped up. This time I have it, but I'm just going to call. 
No one believes me anyway. It's amazing. I just tell them I have it, I have it, and they don't believe me. Right? I don't have it. I'm, so? I'll just tell you that. 8-4-4 four, four on the flop, so Phil's sevens, still in the lead. David drawing extremely thin, needing one of Phil's sevens to make his straight. Of course, if Phil was still in the pot, he would have a full house. But David will start the betting for 500. Schwann may want to stick around with her deuces. We'll see. David definitely the loosest at the table. He likes to open up his game and take a lot of chances. But now Schwann will stick around. It's surprising since David has a reputation as a more snug and conservative player, and that's how he generally approaches tournaments. But tonight, he's clearly having some fun and wants to see some flops, doing a lot of betting. He's got one of those great perceptions at the table. He looks conservative, he acts conservative, and yet he has this mix-up game that's quite crafty, if you ask me. I can see why he's a very successful player. Now he does get this pot heads up for Schwan, who makes the call with deuces and oh. nails a deuce for the full house on the turn. David is drawing dead. And she's going to trap. Check, check. They go. River card three. And that oh. makes David a straight. 2,000. Fiasco for David Baker. He's only got a not that much more if he wants to call a raise. I mean, he must. Most likely, he thinks he's going to be in front. I would believe I was in front if I was in David's shoes. I'd be stoked about where I am in this hand. Absolutely. It's so hard for Schwann to have a full house. She has to have a pocket pair. All in, 1,300 more. And he's going to push all in. He's on a short stack, says, what the heck? Yeah. It's only 1,300 more? Jesus, that makes it so much worse. She seems a little perplexed by this. Maybe just wants to clarify how much the raise is, but I'm surprised she hasn't called yet with such a huge hand and facing this small raise. Yeah, obviously an insta-call. She's... <laughs> Sometimes I'll have it. It's only 1,300 more. David has to believe his straight is best. He expects to get snapped by any full house, so he's likely sitting there confident that There she straight. goes. I have a boat. You have a vote? I have a vote. Yeah, I thought I almost didn't raise. Jesus. <laughs> I can't believe it. He's stunned. So is the table. <laughs> I almost didn't raise. David, always a good sport. I mean, that was a slow roll, Matt. That was, that was like the slow roll. Uh, OK, I mean. I'm the one that has a bigger pair than you. This is why he only plays Nolan like once a year. <laughs> Brutal. We're giving away $50. It's very simple. Here's how. Step one, go to WPTGlobal.com. Step two, sign up using bonus code YT77. Step three, deposit at least $1. And you better act quickly because we're only giving away $50 to 100 people. When Juan called, I had sevens, and I'm like, she I might, really... I, all of a sudden I was like, does she have fives? And I said, no, no. I really don't, like... she would never call with fives or sixes here. Yeah. She called with ducks. <laughs> the only way I don't win a big pot I had and position, not get what can rolls. I say? My goodness, I might win 30,000 today. <laughs> Nobody knows I have it every <laughs> hand. <laughs> they don't even know I have it every Actually, hand. Actually, if I had lose 30, that'd probably be a good day. That's about my over under. <laughs> Jamie <laughs> completes with the queen jack of clubs. But, I mean, I, I can't believe I got such a little play with the aces. I made it so easy for you to call 700 more. You would have got me. I'd have just shoved it in your Horse. face. With no, you, no, you would have called with any had. two. No, I would have just shoved it on you. I, didn't think, I don't think you had anything. But I'm not very good at reading, obviously. I, I, thought, I thought I had her beat when she said, uh, that's She will make the call. You had the read. You had the read. You had the read. Sometimes, sometimes when somebody has aces, I know something's wrong, but I, I don't figure out it's actually aces. <laughs> Eight of spades on the I turn. Know, I don't think aces is something wrong. I'm about 400. I, I'm very happy when I have aces. I think right, but, but there's there's a different like modality, you know. Like... Does Jamie want to stick around with two overs in the gut shot? Well, look at this. She's gonna check raise. Wow. Me. What? It's <laughs> a good sign. <laughs> and I love this play from Jamie Kersetter. I mean, can you be raising with like 10-9 and just be dead? Of course you would. No, I don't think you're stupid enough to do that against me. <laughs>
She definitely can't be racing with 10-9 and be dead. She could be one or the other. She can't be both with 10-9. Everyone's always dead to Phil. You can't be There's dead. No ass. You can't be racing with 10-9 and be dead. She speared an eight. <laughs> I kind of like it. Maybe I'll fold top pair five times against you, and then when you have top pair against me, you'll give me 5,000. Him. Wait, can I get a blow nine. up? Can I get a blow up? No, I want I, I want your crazy play. Oh, yeah, she blew up the throw. Got him. <laughs> nice. I don't mind. I like it. Thanks. I want action. Trust me. Well, she said at the top of the show that was her plan for the night, and she gets it done. Yeah. You remember Paul? Mm -hmm. Row what? That book Scott with the king nine. Getting out. But Phil with ace nine goes to 150. Oh, is that? I, yeah, I don't remember the other guy. Into but I'm pretty David. sure Blair Rodman wrote. He will fold, and Jamie goes out. Schwan with a pair of fours. Makes the call, so heads up with Phil. What'd you think of that book? Which book? The Kill Phil. I gave them permission to use my photo on the cover, but they wanted to have a trigger on me, like the, the and I said, no, 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 I, there might be some psycho out there. Just put it over on the side. Yeah. <laughs> no trigger pointing at you. I think that's smart. Done. Turn cards at ace. So Phil now hits aces. He's going to trap again with a check, and now he's going to bet. Do you consider yourself the greatest Phil to ever play poker? <laughs> 800. Greatest she check raises to 800 and the snap call from the poker brat. It's a great question. So Schwan will fill up once more. Do you consider yourself the greatest Davis to play poker? The greatest Davis Baker might not even to play be poker. Greatest Davis Baker. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I consider myself the greatest David Baker. I don't consider myself the greatest David. Greatest David Baker. <laughs> Isn't it brutal that they made you an old David Baker, though? I'm original. <laughs> I'm, the original. <laughs> I'm the original, not old. Oh, sorry. OK, there's 2,000. <laughs> I mean, what the is going on here? I fold the top pair three times or four times already. This is incredible. Why you got to be like this? You guys are supposed to give me the money. Yeah, Schwan has got the pot here. <laughs> King's kind of off suits. It's not Either cheap way, for it's Phil to see to her hand. Hmm. And Juan Luce, the most aggressive of all of them. The one who I promised I was going to call. I promised myself I was going to call every time. <laughs> Why does it have to be this way? <laughs> Why don't they just make it easy on you? Well, how many of how many of you guys have folded top pair once? Zero for me. I don't know about anybody else. <laughs> <laughs> anybody else fold top pair? <laughs> zero. I couldn't fold it. It's <laughs> Scott zero. We've already seen that. <laughs> no, I haven't folded top pair. All right. Well. So far, we're over. I have to let her bluff me. She's going to give it all away dead later, right? Please let me bluff you. What's that? Nothing. Well, <laughs> she looks very relaxed. This would be a solid lay down if Phil could possibly lay this down. No, this feels more bluffy to me. I was wrong last time, though. All right, Phil. All right, you people at home, I'm going to fold this. Just fast forward to three hours and see what the stack looks like. And remember how they just gave me the money. 10 8 diamonds? I think she might have 10 8 diamonds. You want to see a card? Yeah, this one. No. And she's going to oh, show one card. One card. It just feels unfair. <laughs> I would never raise in a million haters here. Phil Helmuth has a pair of fours and makes the call. I can't raise one up. <laughs> I would raise an amazing year, sure, but I'm not going to. <laughs> this is not one of those times. All so right, nobody's flop. super aggressive. Everybody is sus. Poor Scott. <laughs> Left out. Would <We'll> never <laughs> raise in this spot. Who's going to get lucky? Not Scott Baumstein. That's all I know for sure. Can I check? No one on that flop. Ace 3-3. Three, three. Everyone checks. That air all around. Ooh, four of clubs on the turn will fill up Helmuth. Meanwhile, David Baker 
has a seemingly strong draw with clubs and a gut shot to the five. So he's going to raise this small bet from Phil up to 400. I like the $100 bet. It looks like not a monster hand. He's just tempting players to raise him. That's exactly what he got David to do. And now he's in a great place to punish him a bit. And he is thinking about it. This could be his moment, he's thinking. Four's full on the turn. And there's the raise, total of 14. Now David, four to the flush, possible straight. So no slouch of a hand here. However, old rule was never put in money if you catch and you still can't win. That's David very... didn't get the memo, though. Didn't get that memo. And he's not going to get this hand. Quite lucky, actually, that he did not hit here. And Phil is getting those chips out. Looks like 2,500. Never a good sign when your opponent doesn't bother to count his bet out and just sticks in a stack. Pretty big tell about how strong they feel that they don't even care how much they're betting, but David with the queen high, of course, not going to pay that one off. Spicy. Mm. What the hell just happened? <laughs> you tell us. I needed you to have his hand. <laughs> He might have folded a three. I don't think so. No, I don't think he's that good. A three was drawing dead, so dead. You said aces, and you're like, I would never raise here. <laughs> three was drawing dead, stone cold dead. I should have checked. Maybe he had six high or something, five high. I think you're right. That's a big tell. I would never raise here either. I would never call her. Player doesn't even count it out, just sticks it in there. Right. I'm going to start using that with a bluff, Tony. That's a good idea. You get me you get me out with that now one. That we've established what we would never do. <laughs> I never say Easy never. call. Easy call. And, uh, I'll check. Her. I do everything sometimes. And we get an 853, two diamonds and a spade flop. So good looking board for David Baker. And ODB fires out 300. Phil, believing he may be in front. Check. Or maybe he just has six outs, makes the call. Three of spades on the turn. Another check in the dark from Phil. David bets 700. Be careful, spades. Yeah, he's getting a little stubborn here. I thought we'd check. established that states, spades are no longer good. The seven of diamonds doesn't change either of these players' hands. Ace king. Then they'll go check, check. So David will win a nice pot with the eight, six of spades. Phil with the ace king. That was your chance, Phil. Has to flick it into the muck. David has unraveled the tight image he spent 20 years building tonight, bluffing his face off in this game, but he has been great entertainment and handling the losses with grace. Limpy, limpy. Look at this. Helmuth with aces, gonna try to disguise the strength of the hand with just a call. Oh, boy. Jamie gonna limp behind with jack nine suited. Schwan completes ace nine, and Scott will check queen eight from the big blind. So four players to this limp pot. And it is jack, jack, eight, two diamonds. So Jamie with trip jacks in position is drawn out on Phil. That's the downside of playing aces slow. You sometimes get burned and, uh... Sometimes it works for you, but this time in a bad place. Now, Jamie's not going to raise this, so that's interesting. Turn seven. That will complete 9-10. Jamie blocks that with the nine of clubs in her hand. Phil, undeterred by all of this action, bets 200. Jamie still slow playing, so maybe the river is where she plans to raise. You would think so. Let's see this river card. It's a do so. Nice. Helmy feels comfortable. He thinks he's in front, of course. Never been raised. He's betting 300. Aces. What? Where is the raise, Jamie? Come on. You finally trapped us, Phil. Trapped <laughs> Phil only bet Too third soon. pot on the river. I mean, more money needs to go in there. And I know that Phil can play very tight. But Jamie, with a strong hand, left a lot of money on the table there with her trip jacks. And we would have had a whining call, even if she raises about 1,200. Absolutely. 
Which she should have. We missed out on more money for Jamie and a Phil Hellmuth blow up. I, I feel cheated. I had a different outcome in mind, especially with Jamie. Because, I mean, she's already shown me she's going to she's gonna bluff me, so... <laughs> I need, like, the 7-8 deuce flop, and she's like, I'm going to bluff Phil. I, have, I need a 10 for a straight. I'm going to raise him. I got it out of my system. I bluffed wow. him. Wow, he, he's, he's giving you a southern accent. Where did that come from? She's from New Jersey. Yeah, that's not, that's not particularly surprising. Scott, folding 6-5 here. Phil with ace-deuce will limp in. David with the seven nine of spades, raises it up to 200. Why did you do that? I was trapping Juan Lu here. Phil sitting pretty tonight, thinking how well it's going. I think he really feels he has an advantage at this table, and now he's got chips. I never re-raise when I'm supposed to. Well, if nobody's okay. gonna fold to Phil when he starts putting in money post-flop, he does have an advantage at this table. That's why the hotels are... And what a flop. 10-6-5, two spades. David with the flush draw and the gut shot. Neither of his opponents hitting. So his bet of 500 likely to wow. get through. Wow, this time, huh? Did you uh, flop me? Phil lets this one go. So David Baker trying to rebuild after the early losses. We'll see if he can get it back. I'm impressed because she ran a five-minute mile back in the day when she went to Rutgers. That's fast. And she is quite a competitor. And she's raising up the Jack-10 here to 150. Schwann's right behind her, lets that one go. OK, let's try again. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. Waiting? Now, I'm going to check. Did you see that in the dark? Doing pretty What's good doing that waiting yeah. game. 200 in the dark. I like to see the flop first. Okay. I know it's cheating, but... <laughs> For pretend reasons? <laughs> yeah. Oops. Nine, eight, three. Two spades and a diamond on the flop. OK, I call. Mm -hmm. Somehow I'm going to fold this on the turn, though. You said you're going to fold the turn? That's Somehow great. Somehow I'm going to fold great the news. turn against you. Yeah, no, I mean, <laughs> I like I'm not supposed to. I'm going to check. I'm going to check. <laughs> Check's in the dark now. It's probably You're probably going to fold the turn. No, I can't fold what the turn. What a liar. Oh, my god. Let's it's see. Up. How deep are you? Eight? Yeah, yeah. Pretty tough to put Phil on a worse draw, okay. but that is what he has. Call or raise is on the table. Phil has pretty consistently fast played his strong hands. Well, why not just play every hand weak against her all day? That's, that's what you do, Phil. Poker's so more. frustrating. Oh, no, they're stuck together. Lovely. So after <laughs> some deliberation, he makes the call. River can. Phil catch the flush, no five. He's going to check it. I mean, I don't, I don't think you're going to fold a nine. Check. I think you win, Jack. Huh? Jack. And Jamie thinks she's lost, but little does she know. You jack seven? Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> and with, that's a nightmare for him. It won't be long now, I tell you. I had a bump you check the river. So there you go. <laughs> because I, he's never folding to me, ever. We're giving away $50. It's very simple. Here's how. Step one, go to WPTGlobal.com. Step two, sign up using bonus code YT77. Step three, deposit at least $1. And you better act quickly because we're only giving away $50 to 100 people. Jamie going out. As is Schwann, Scott going. Phil limp, jack four suited on the button. Maria completes seven deuce. David will check 10-3. So three players going to the flop with junky hands, and it is ace, jack 10. Does that tell you anything about my plan, so that I just checked out jack high to you on the river? I checked back too. You're just telling me I bluff you all the time. I just showed down jack 10 high, and you were good. Yeah, <laughs> I was thinking about value betting, you know, but. And the turn card is a queen, so scary wow. card for both players. You called 75. You deserve it. It's going to work just for 200. I had a jack. Pushes Phil out of that pot. Good hit. David wearing down late into the night. I don't trust anybody this time. I'm going to make it 400. So. Jamie's so sticky. To, uh, hmm. 400, whoa, that's a lot of money. 
Raising up East 9 to 400 on the button. David Baker. All right, let's see if we can find Stuck play big tonight though. in a rush to play some big pots. He's going to three bet 9 7 offsuit wow. to 1400. I'm pretty sure that you just went crazy because you think I'm weak. But I'm not weak. I have at least ace nine. But I'm gonna let you steal one from me because I know you're. I know I'm gonna get you later. <laughs> you're always gonna get you later. I knew it. Yeah, I knew it. You can't help yourself. You're very I can't predictable. Help myself. That I should have just moved in. I can't help myself. I should have just moved in. <laughs> I, just moved in. in like, I know. I know he wants to give it to me. He thought I was weak because I made it 400. Right. And he's like, "Well, Phil limps every time he has exactly. it." Exactly. I like that when Phil raises, we could take out the top of his range. <laughs> 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 see you you're trying to dissect everything which i love because you guys all make all these assumptions and they're all wrong because i know what you're thinking so my only mistake is i should have just taken the free 1600 right there i should have just you moved should've in. Just moving on what are you doing phil if i could go back i would have called i folded so quickly you can't be making hasty folds you gotta think no, about it's, it's every just, spot it's it's a, it's a, it's it's you and it's late you know? right right and, and i'm stuck i'm trying yep, to get it back exactly trying to, play one trying big to pot. pump up a pot exactly, exactly. david baiting you, you think about these bit. spots you i didn't i mean i made right. a mistake yeah that could cost plus you. i'm picking up a hand every hand and so it's kind of fun for me so Whoa, and great. you don't believe me anyway so I believe you this time. This time, David, just yeah. going to call. That's why I'm just going to call. I'm not going to three bet. <laughs> I got to make sure I can see a flop this time. Other times, uh, who cares? Queen eight three, rainbow with a spade. Neither yeah. player connects. Check, check, and the king of hearts on the turn. Puts David in the lead. Five. Phil will bet five. David makes the call. Deuce on the river. Now David will lead out for a thousand. Oh, <laughs> and my kicker. I know you did. <laughs> Probably stone cold dead again. Mm. How do they keep hitting <laughs> kickers on me? What if I have Jack Ten though? He hit his kicker again. Huh? What if I have Jack Ten? Phil's trying to act like he was stronger than he was, that he got beat on the turn or whatever. Just be happy, buddy. Okay. I had it. <laughs> Just be happy. You hit your kicker. I am happy. I it's happy. getting late, too. We're going to, like, if we, if you don't hit your kicker, the pots are going to get really big all of a sudden. And I'm ready. Phil is ready for the <laughs> asylum, if you ask me. He's just <laughs> talking to himself. I reject him. Great job, Juan. A dominating performance despite Phil's best efforts. Overall, three players finished with a profit and three in the red, with David taking the big hit. Thanks to all of tonight's players for the oh, dynamic yeah, action yeah. and lively conversation. <laughs> and thanks to all of you for tuning in. We'll see you next time on the WPT.